So you have a Toshiba or Insignia Fire TV. I'm gonna show you how to wipe the cache partition, okay? Which is right here. First thing we gotta do is we need to boot into the Android recovery menu. Now wiping the cache partition, you're basically deleting temporary files. And doing that can help if you have like delay issues or app issues with your uh, apps, errors, no sound. So it's the same thing as like on the Android phone. You're not going to lose any data or anything like that too, okay? So again, it's white cache partition, all right? So now I'm using a Toshiba Fire TV here. What you want to look for is the, the power button that's on the, um, on the TV. Now my Toshiba Fire TV, it's on the left-hand side here, okay? Now, or where is it? It's right here. You see the power input button right here? Now on my uh, Insignia, I think it's somewhere like in the very middle on the bottom or it might be on the right side. So you want to look wherever the... Um, power button is. Okay, so to boot into the Android recovery menu, first thing we want to do is just go ahead and unplug the TV. So go to the TV, let's pull the plug, okay? Next thing we want to do is we want to press and hold wherever the power button is. You want to press and hold and then go ahead and plug your TV back in and continue to hold this power button until the sheep or until the Fire TV logo pops up. So we're going to do this together, okay? I'm going to go ahead and press and hold the power button right now. I'm holding. Now I'm going to go ahead and plug it in and I'm still holding. I'm waiting for the uh, logo to pop on the TV. I'm still holding on the power button. I'm just waiting for the Fire TV logo to pop up. Still holding. There it is. Go ahead and let go. And now this is going to boot us into the Android recovery menu. So let me move on over here. And voila, we are in business. Okay, so what we want to do is go down to where it says wipe cache partition, okay? You don't want to go to wipe data slash factory reset or you're going to be resetting the whole entire TV. So go down to wipe cache partition. How you go down, just go back to the power button on wherever the power button is on the TV and just press. Every time you press, it should go down. Okay, go down there, go down here, go down here. Now, I want to select wipe cache partition. Simply just press and hold. Press and hold now. So if I just press and hold, it's autom Okay, I'm still, okay. So now I'm on this menu here. This cannot be undone. Do you want to proceed? We're going to cache partition. Click it once, we're going to go down to yes. Now we're going to select yes. So we're going to press and hold and just wait. Okay, now it's already working. Cache complete. Okay, you're done. Now just go ahead and reboot system now. Press and hold the power button. And then voila, you just wiped your cache partition. Hopefully your whatever issue you had is now fixed. Good luck.